Hello YouTubers and welcome to another Disney Pixar Cars Diecast Review. And today we're going to take a look at Fred, one of the Rusty's fans. Now before we get right into the review, let me discuss something. So, Fred is a Rusty Stoggy Swaver LT sedan who uh, who was one of the Rusty's fans gathering at inside a Rusty's tent at the Motor Speedway of the South in 2005 after the Dynaco 400 yeah. awaiting Lightning Mc their biggest hero Lightning McQueen to make a personal appearance for his sponsor presented by Rusty and Dusty Rusties. Voiced by Andrew Stanton, who works on other Pixar films like Toy Story and Finding Nemo and so on and so forth. Fred was excited, and the other fans were excited to see Lightning Ender, even though he disliked Rusty's and Rusty Cars at first. Fred stated that he is his hero, and then and Lightning re and thanked him and, and recognized his name from his front license plate, which Fred states that he knows his name, causing his bump, rusty bumper to fall off, even though he doesn't know that his name is on his front license plate. Later on in the film, he attended the Los Angeles International Speedway for the tiebreaker race, and he, he was unable to enter the pit, enter the, the fan stadium you know, by a security car named Marco Axelbender, who I don't have, you know, and without a garage pass. And then Mario Andretti, along with Patty, who I don't have, showed up nope, by stating to Marco that it was a nice day for a race. And then and he bidded Fred a good day to him and mentioned his name, which makes Fred excited. And during the epilogue of the film, he... He was jumping up and down when he received many bumper stickers in Radiator Springs, causing his front bumper to fall off again. And in the Cars video game, Mater National, Fred came to Radiator Springs overhearing Lightning McQueen and a... and a... British car named Philip about he about racing le private racing lessons which Fred got excited about it and demanded I mean begged for lightning and asked and requested lightning to count him in then at that moment Doc Hudson arrived saying that they were blocking his street. Then, then an orange muscle car named Barry, who was one of the Queen's muscle cars from the first Cars video game, to arrive in Ormond Valley under the secret recruiting by Chick Hicks, had joined and they and all five joined in in the Radiator Spring Circuit race. 
and during his diecast release, he was released a bit bigger compared to Lightning McQueen, but in later versions, he was re-released again, but this time in a smaller version. So hopefully I'll get the smaller version of this guy. And now, without any further ado, let's dig, get right into the review. Here we've got his happy facial expression, his rusty paint and his grill and headlights and teeth and in his rusty bumper and his license plate saying Fred. No tampos, just the rust and the side view mirrors and, and on the left side we've got his doors and and on the rusty rims on his black wall tires. On the back side we've got the tail lights and no back license plate, just the back bumper and the trunk and the exhaust pipes. And on the right side, similar design but completely different. And that is it. Now let's compare them to, no, I mean, let's pull up some of the other stoggy vehicles such as the stoggy swafers such as Krusty Rodor, Floyd Mulvihill, Murray Clutchburn, and some of the other race fans like Craig Faster, Jonathan Renschworths, Mia and Tia, or should I say Excited Mia and Tia, or our correction, Superfan Mia and Tia, Manny McGear, Melissa Burnabreak, Timothy Two Strokes, JW, Christina Wheeland, Kid Rebster, Vern and T Tim Matthew True Blue McCrew. And that is it. So, like, what do you guys think? Which stoggy vehicle is your favorite, and which Russ race fan is your favorite? Leave your thoughts in the comments down below, as well as leaving any suggestions of which car from the car collection video should I review next. And if you have enjoyed this video, I hope you leave a like and subscribe for more. Also, don't forget to check out some of my other videos on my channel for public watch hours, and consider the support by subscribing and viewing my, on my channel for public watch hours and subscribers. I would really appreciate it very much. And I hope to see you guys next time for another review, so please stay tuned. Goodbye now!